welcome to our vlog. So today we are going to a tourism site. Actually, this is religious tourism site that located in central Jakarta. I'm so sorry, you're just me in this opening part because my friend is a little bit shy. So let's go. Cathedral has an official name called Santa Maria Patron appointed to heaven. The church itself is located in Jakarta that was inaugurated in 1901 and was built with a neo-gothic architecture from Europe. The architecture is very commonly used to build church buildings a few centuries ago. The cathedral church that we know today is not the original church building in that place because the original cathedral church was inaugurated in February 1810 and on 27th of July, 1826, the church building was burned. Now, the church located near the Merdeka Palace at Jalan Cathedral 2 and stands right across Jakarta's largest mosque, the Istiqlal Mosque. Even that it stands across another religious worship place, but there never have been any conflict between both. President Sukarno intend to use it as an opportunity to symbolize the nation philosophy of unity in diversity, in which all religions could coexist in peace and harmony. In fact, both church and mosque coexistence has bring both a lot of benefit in which both accommodate talking up with one another during religious festivals. This place is well organized and have a fine security, in which every side of the building has a security post that is always available for us if we need any help. The parking lot was very wide, so that it will always be easy for us to park our car. The environment is very well maintained and there's no garbage to be seen. Although Cathedral Church was also considered as a tourist destination, this place didn't make profit because there isn't any entrance fee needed to enter or visit the church. But other than that, we can also carry out wedding ceremony in this church. Cathedral Church also had some rules and regulations, in which visitors should always keep their ethics in check. Shouting is prohibited, breathing is prohibited, inappropriate clothes aren't allowed, no smoking, no headphone and edge. Our conclusion is that Cathedral Church is one of Indonesian local wisdom that needs to be protected and preserved, and this place also has museums and libraries that keeps the history of spreading of Catholic in the land of Jakarta.